All right. Hello, stampers and friends. Today we are doing something that is called um, s'mores in a jar. This is one I did for a Halloween type of theme. And you can see, I hope I'm showing okay. You can see the recipe on this side. They are two different cards, one with the little googly ghouls with his googly eyes. And in here we have the ingredients for the s'mores, right there. So we have the googly ghouls and then the bingo spooky bingo bits. All I did was layer the different um, pieces of cardstock and put them together with some ribbon. It's coming to that time of year for um, craft fairs and things like this, and these sell so fast. I'm going to show you how to do one that is for fall. And you can also change these out for Easter. You can make them for Christmas. You can make them for Hanukkah. You can make them for any kind of holiday. I'm sure you can see the possibilities. Using the die cut called Autumn Accents, it has leaves on it. I did some leaves out of the champagne glimmer paper. Now I'm going to take a large piece of Whisper White and I'm going to make the leaves out of that using my Big Shot. The great thing about this is that it matches the Wonderfall stamp set. Using the more mustard, I put the oak leaf on the clear and now I'm going to just ink it up. Because it's clear, I can line it up pretty well. It may not be perfect, that's okay. See how nicely that came out? Now I'm going to do the maple leaf and I'm going to do the rock and roll technique with it. And then the cherry cobbler. That's beautiful. With these several leaves now, I'm just going to decorate my piece that I have here and tie it together with some ribbon. Punching a hole in the whole thing using what is now retired, my crocodile. I think I need to aim them up a little better here. Line them up, I guess, not aim them up. Line them up a little bit better. And I'm using the big end hole through the whole thing and now I'm going to put a hole through my tag that has my recipe on it. The ribbon I'm using today is the soft suede taffeta as well as the eighth inch taffeta. It's much smaller and I want a lot of ribbon. It ends up looking so pretty when you have a lot. Tying them both around. Now I'll begin to thread my recipe. And now the leaves. Just a little bit of a tie. <laughs> it's sideways. There, a beautiful s'mores in a jar that is just fantastic for the fall season. And like I said before, we've got the Halloween one. So I hope you um, get out there and make something creative and have fun today. Thank you for joining me.